Hey, welcome back to my channel. So, first, everyone on YouTube beats their face, like, to the next level. So, I'm going to have to step up my YouTube game. So, I went to Sephora and I picked up this contour stick and dark. So, I'm going to be testing that out for you guys and giving you guys a review today. I don't like to be outdone by anyone, so I'm going to get this contour game on fleek by the end of this video. So, I'm going to start off with this primer. Just going to, you know... I've never really used primer before, so... Right now, I'm applying my CoverGirl Outlast All Day Primer. This came with part of the Target On The Roll Beauty Box. I'll give you guys more information about that at the end of this video. But right now, I'm just applying the primer all over my skin and a little foundation as well before I get into the Sephora Contour Stick. ...by the end of this video. So the box comes with, like, a little, like, instruction map right here. I don't know if you guys can tell, but... I'm just about to do this, and I'll let you guys know. So this is the pen and a D, and let's see how this goes. Get the highlight. It's really, really creamy and nice. So here I'm taking the highlight side of the Sephora contour stick and I'm creating shadows on my face. So I'm highlighting underneath my eyes, underneath my chin, and down my T-zone as well. Okay y'all, so I was making some serious progress and I forgot the water to my sponge. You always want to use a damp sponge. I have no idea why, but apparently it works a lot better. So okay, so I just finished blending all of the highlight on my face. So far I think it looks really good. It worked more of a concealer than anything else. I mean, my skin looks flawless. But now, okay. I am going to do the contouring part. Focusing again on my box because I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just going to do the contour line here. Contour line here. Right under here. So here, I'm just taking the other side of the Sephora contour stick, and I'm contouring underneath my cheekbones, around my jawline, around the rim of my face, and then off camera, I also added some contour down the outskirts of my nose. I'm using a different sponge here. This sponge is from Sephora. It cost me about $7, and I am just beating out the... Uh, the contour side. I am using a different sponge just because I didn't want to mix the two colors together in one sponge. So just keeping my makeup, you know, separate. I don't know if you guys can see me, but so it's all blended out. I actually really like the finished product. Yeah, it looks like really natural. Those really like contouring made easy. I'm going to go ahead and scrub some more. Well, not scrub, not going to actually screw my face but I'm just going to go ahead and apply like just a little bit more foundation overneath or on top of and I'm going to go ahead and just do the rest of my makeup you guys really don't need to see that I'm just going to like do my eyebrows and my eyeshadow real quick and I'll be right back hey guys I'm back so this is the finished product so I added a little bit more like contour on my like nose and underneath my cheeks off camera just because in person it looked like really nice but on camera it kind of looked the same so I just did that just so you guys could see it better. Um, below I'm going to link for the Target Beauty Box if you guys want to try that out. I think it's really cool because it's only 5 bucks and you get like all that crap. So I'll give you the link of... Um, that and I'll give you the link to the contour stick if you guys want to share that out as well Please come on my videos. I really want to hear from you guys So let me know what you think. Let me know what videos you guys want to see from me Let me know things because I like to talk to you guys and I will see you guys next time because you know I'm gonna go have a life and you know do things I'm playing. I'm probably just gonna go watch Netflix, but I'll see you guys next time Now I'm wearing zero makeup and I just wanted to share some tips for you guys so, every, like, fall semester, Target does this beauty box thing, and it's amazing. So, for $5, I got this really cute, like, loafah, some, like, body wash, whatever. Got this CoverGirl Outlast Primer, which is what I'm going to be testing today. And a bunch of other stuff, like, some hair ties, Burt's Bees, um, base, whatever.
whatever. Um, some 7 day volume hair treatment. I haven't tried this. I might test it out. I don't even know if I'm going to use it. We'll see. And this NYX, like, lip butter, which is, oh my god, it's so nice. Like, honestly, I love it. It's like a gloss. It's like, I feel like I'm a 90s kid again. Like, I feel like it's so hard to find good gloss. Like, I definitely recommend this. I really love it. And it comes with a coupon. Y'all know I love a good coupon. So, definitely probably going to cut out these products for you. And I'm going to put the link down below to see um, if you guys want to order B-Box for yourself. It was only $5 for this entire box. So, I definitely recommend it.